Now for the color part, let me warm this up. I'm going to be using Color Tattoo by Maybelline and I'm using the color Tough as Taupe. It's this. I know I've said on Instagram that I haven't been using my MAC products a whole lot and people have been asking me questions why not and blah blah blah. The MAC stuff that I showed in, um, on Instagram is from my personal collection. This has nothing to do with the products that I use on my clients. Um, a lot of my clients like the fact that I use MAC and they specifically ask if I use MAC. So yeah, I use MAC. But um, for me, I like to use a mix of different things. But today, I'm going to be using all MAC. All MAC. So let's get started. Everything I've used will be in the description box below. sure they're called the name they're matte colors and mix them for my transition shade I'm not used to using these two colors on me but we're gonna make it work especially for a transition shade but I like the way it came out over here so why not over here take espresso because I know that this is espresso which is a matte brown shade and use that in my crease and blend it. I'm so sorry. Next I'm going to take a flat shader brush and I'm going to go into a matte black color And just place it on my lid. Whoa, buddy. Where's my phone? Okay. Now, it's time to blend again. Isn't it great? <clears throat> so, I'm going to take my Sigma E25 blending brush. Take a little bit of black on it. Very, very little bit of black on it. And use that to blend out the harsh lines. know why I'm in such a like a weird mood today so this is it so far next I'm going to add where's my baby I'm gonna add the glitter the glitter is here these glitters can be purchased from Beauty Diary on on Depop market it is an app that you download from your uh, phone and then you just sign up for Depop market and they have their um, look up Beauty Diary so this glitter here I'm going to use and I'm going to apply it with liquid sugar 
from Eye Candy Cosmetics. So I will be back and let you see the completed look. Well, with foundation and everything. And then we're going to complete it together. Okay, we're back. And I'm not done with my eyes yet. As you guys can tell, um, I still have to do my eyes and my lips. So I'm going to take the blending, the tapered blending brush, and I'm going to go back into these two colors here. Uh, I didn't do my hair yet. And I'm going to just go right under the lash line and place that color there. Like so. Right under the lash line. Do it to both eyes. Then I'm going to go back in with Espresso from MAC and do the same thing and build intensity. Until I get it where I want it. Now, I'm taking a smaller brush because I'm, I'm going to go in with black. Ah, black. But, take a little bit. We're going to do one eye at a time again. I don't want it, I want to leave right where the gold is at on here, just plain. So I'm going to go on this side and just smudge it right close 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 to the lash line like that then I'm going to do the same to this side okay the reason why we left that naked is because we're going to do something fun I'm going to take a, we're going to take a MAC pigment. I'm using Melon by MAC, which I also like to use as a highlight, but that's neither here nor there. And I'm going to place it there. Yay! Okay, the Melon pigment could come down some. It's not a big deal. You could, like, if you drop some, melon pigment come down to about there. I'm going to do is add my highlight and I'm using my Sedona lace fan brush for my highlight and I'm using soft and gentle by Mac it's gonna use light capade but I haven't touched soft and gentle in a long time and I miss her so I'm just gonna sweep soft and gentle onto my highlight Do it to the other side. So for blush, I'm going to use Format by MAC and I'm going to mix it with Margin, Amber and Rose. So I'm going to mix Amber and Rose and Format together by MAC for my blush. I'm a blush, blush fanatic. I like to blush my cheeks and in between the highlight and the contour. 
little bit of both. You know what I'm saying? Cool. But this is the look here. So I hope you guys all enjoyed it and I will see you guys later. Bye. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this look. Um, I will be doing more tutorials and everything. I want to say hello to my new subscribers and thank you for subscribing. And if you shared my videos, thank you so much. Um, and to my old subscribers, you already know what it is. I love you all. You guys are amazing. I mean, I love my new subscribers too. You guys are awesome. Um, we're getting closer to my giveaway. So yeah, I'm really excited about that. So I will see you guys and I love you all.